Rwandan authorities have accused Burundian leader Evariste Ndaishimi of making inflammatory allegations in at sowing division among Rwandans, reigniting tensions that have persisted since Burundi closed all border crossing with Rwanda earlier this month. Relations between Rwanda and Burundi have deteriorated since recent weeks after Burundian President Evariste renewed accusations that Rwanda was funding and training the Red Sabara rebels. Burundian authorities consider Red Sabara a terrorist movement and accuse its members of participating in the field coup attempt in 2015. The group first emerged in 2011 and has been accused of a series of attacks in Burundi since 2015. Speaking at an event in the Congolese capital Kinshasa on Sunday, Mr. Ndaishimiye spoke of Rwandan youth in captivity and said the region must continue to fight until the Rwandan people put pressure on their government. In a statement released late Monday, Rwandan authorities described Daishimiye's remarks as inflammatory and said calls for an uprising against the government undermine Rwanda's unity and threaten regional security. Earlier this month, Burundi closed all borders crossing with Rwanda and began expelling Rwandan citizens, saying it was responding to Rwanda's alert support for Red Sabara. The rebels attacked the Burundian village of Gatumba near the Congolese border last month, killing at least 20 people. The situation has strained relations between the two members of the East African community and has implications for regional stability.